I recently got a soldering iron and a collection of six soldering iron tips from the DigitSpace. DigitSpace is an open source hardware provider. They supply innovative, user-friendly open source hardware products at extremely low prices, ranging from boards to corresponding components and kits for worldwide community of engineers, designers, inventors and makers who love creating electronics. DigitSpace provides worldwide shipping at low cost. This is a 220 volts, 60 watt European standard electrical soldering iron kit. There are two more packages of the same soldering iron kit designed for the United States and China. The amazing thing about this soldering iron kit is that it comes with the adjustable temperature knob. You can select any temperature between 200 and 450 centigrade. Currently the temperature is set to 250 as melting point of most solder is in the range of 188 centigrade and the soldering iron tip temperature is typically 330 centigrade. So I'm going to start with 250 centigrade which later I can adjust as per the requirement. There are hundreds of different types of soldering iron tips available in different sizes and shapes used in everything from jewelry making to plumbing. But in this video I will talk about the four most common soldering iron tips used for electronics work which are conical or B series tips, bevel or C series tips, chisel or T series tips and knife type or K series tips. Let's start with the conical or B series tips. These are the conical or B series soldering iron tips. Due to its round shape, the soldering can be done from any angle. Because of this, B series tips are widely used for general purpose soldering and that's the reason almost 99% of the soldering irons available in the market comes with the conical or B series tips. This one looks like a needle which is also known as the I series tip. This soldering iron tip is used for the detailed work. Because of its really small tip, it is not able to transfer a lot of heat making it difficult to solder larger electronic components. Let's watch the conical or BC soldering iron tips in action. This is the bevel or C-series soldering iron tip. Although bevel or C-series tips are not as common as the conical or B-series tips, but can be used for soldering jobs that require pre-loading the tip with solder. Due to its large slightly curved surface, 
it can hold more solder than most other tips. It can be very helpful in soldering small gauge wires together or Drake soldering. The bevel type or C series tips can be really helpful in applying small amounts of the solder over multiple components in close proximity such as the pins of the surface mount component. Let's watch the bevel or C series soldering iron tip in action. This is a chisel type or D-series tip which almost looks like a screwdriver. This is my favorite one. Just like the B-series tips, the D-series tips are also used for the general purpose soldering. The main difference is that the D-series tips offer a much larger surface area on the face and tip due to which more heat can be transferred from the soldering iron to the electronic component which makes the soldering job really easy. The DC steps are ideal for quick soldering application and for soldering large electronic components. The DC steps can also be used for the Drake soldering and for soldering thick wise joints due to their ability to transfer more heat. The DC steps are available in different sizes. Select the one as per your requirement. Let's watch the chisel type or DC soldering iron tip in action. This knife-like K-series soldering iron tip is not as famous as the conical or chisel type soldering iron tips but still can be very useful in a wide variety of applications like point soldering, drake soldering and most importantly fixing solder bridges. Let's watch the knife type or K-series soldering iron tip in action.
support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you like today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.